Okay, we have a Corvette going to place some pound on this ring. Right? back a little low so I can keep everything down with this. All right. Now then the steering wheel locks up and then just... Yeah, as long as the steering wheel will lock for me. If not, we've got some straps that we put on the steering wheel. Yeah, no, it'll lock. Will it, will it lock? Okay. Oh, yeah, you yeah. say the keys are in it, right? The keys are in uh, a cup holder. In a cup holder. I promise, we'll be careful. No, I just have a scratch. We've got to start the bottom. Yeah. Yeah. I'll pull forward a little more so we don't have the officer out right here in traffic. Okay. Yeah, so we have to get a five minutes kind of figure out where the, where the door handle was. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's very nice. Just lots of keys in it. I'm gonna come over here and watch. Okay, well the electronic parking brake just set. I just wanted you to know. want to keep it low obviously that front bumper we've got plenty of clearance up there we could probably come up just a little bit more but that's what we're going to do it's still there 100 percent on my battery that's insane that's not right <laughs> i've never seen that before watch it glitch out and have like 14 percent here in about 10 seconds Why you parked here? We saw it and said it parked in this way. But the lady just told me. The lady just told you. It says 0%. So what happened? She said some, he said somebody warned me and said that I can't park over here, but I I said that uh, I was paid. I was I didn't see any signs. It said parking back here. So I went back here and parked. I said, man, you got to pay to park. That you, you come back here, this is it. You, you pay and you go into the parking garage. Well, that's what he's doing now. But he's trying to tell me there's no signs. There's signs on both sides of him right there. But he, somebody warned him. When we come in the thing, he said, he said, some, she told me I, I couldn't park here. I better go get my truck. I don't know who she is, but. Maybe someone told him he couldn't park there when he pulled in and then he saw you pulling in and then came. Maybe that's what it was. Ridiculous. But that's what he said. He was like, you're not coming after my truck. Yeah, I said, yes, I'm, I'm coming after your truck. You're not supposed to be here. And that's when he said, there's no signs. And it said to come back here. And then that's when we pointed out the sign right here that he was parked right next to. And then the other sign over here that he was parked next to. The two new signs that we just put up because everybody would said, was saying that there weren't enough signs. It's 
crazy. It's crazy what people will do. He come running. I seen him running down the alley. But he'd been here for, I uh, been there for at least 40 minutes. Mm -hmm. And I don't know who the, who the warning lady is, but. I have my guesses. Yeah. No. See this come in, no. warning people? I think it's over here. That's what I think. Was he in? I wonder where he was shopping at. I have no idea. I guess, Except I mean, I don't know how much faster I can possibly be, but they need to be, they need to be hooked. Mm -hmm. But the problem is there, I, I, I can't get out and turned around. So right. either I back in from the road and back all the way down so mm -hmm. I can immediately hook them up because by the time I get back there, get the truck turned around and get stuff out, these people are, they're coming, they're running and then we're doing it for free. Yeah. <laughs> Austin got a new car. Sorry, lot security for Country Inn and Suites. Uh, it was a late night last night and he sent me one for the numbered spot and I didn't make it over here either until now. And uh, it's Sunday, Super Bowl Sunday, guys. Got some exciting stuff. Got invited to a Super Bowl party. I'm so excited. Too. So uh, the chief of police here, Gatlinburg, invited us to the Super Bowl party. And uh, lots of good food going to be there. And gosh, we're just flabbergasted, I guess. I don't know, I don't know how else to say it. That's super cool. We're going to go see if we can uh, meet some people that maybe if we haven't met. In, uh... I don't see the Ford over here anymore. I don't see anything. He sent me a picture of it. I think maybe it might be one of these ones that are over here. It is a extended cab gray F-250. No. Maybe they'll be back. Oh look, there's geese. Looking dead over there. Yeah. See, like, like there's nobody working in Gatlinburg on a Sunday, <laughs> I guess. Like normally that parking lot back there is full of... Maybe they're... Workers. Have all their employees coming in for the evening shift. There's not even anybody in the numbered spots. Normally this is all the way from the church, all the way down here to Country Inn and Suites is packed with- uh, Oh my gosh, there's nobody at all. Oh, hold on, there's a car behind you. I know, they've been creeping. I don't know what's going on. I'm trying to turn around, they maybe, see me turn around, they just stop. Maybe because it's Sunday. Maybe because it's Sunday and the church needed all their spots. But that parking lot's empty too. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff empty. So Other than the gravel lot, it's full of employees, so I guess. Somebody staffed. Yeah, those places are staffed. Anyway, that's how, that's how it goes usually. Trips for nothing. Money for nothing. <laughs> Chicks for free. <laughs> do what you're supposed to do. Pay to park! Okay guys, we are up in Shag Bark. Uh, got a call in for this little car. It's got a tire off the road. It looks like a pretty straightforward pull. Um, Maybe... Oh, just turn it. Yeah, turn around here. I guess before I get started, I want to give a shout out to the Shack Bark uh, security, um, the fellow down there. And I'm sorry I didn't catch his name, but um, big thank you to his wife. Uh, his wife uh, has ordered him hats and shirts or something like I don't know. So uh, thank you, whoever you are. <laughs> Maybe I'll catch the name. Let's see if we can get this guy out of his situation here. If I can find my jacket. Because it is nasty, rainy Super Bowl day. And it's five o'clock. Aren't we supposed to be at a party? Yes. The winch. How are you, sir? I've been better. How bad is it on that other side? Ooh, she's hanging there, isn't she? Yeah. All right. Let's see if we can get a maybe a block under it and get her back forward here. Oh, I'm sure it's fine. It's usually just uh, usually that pinch weld. Like it's it's a normal point where they jack them up at, so that usually doesn't hurt them at all because it's got that rail. Everything's really tucked up in there. Okay. So I'm sure you are fine. It's just going to take just a little bit of a. We might build a block up on that other side just to make sure it ramps up a little quick. See if we can get some soft straps on it. This wheel here turned out for me. The uh, emergency uh, I guess you're just getting checked in, huh? Yeah. What a way to start, huh? All these old mountain roads, I'm telling you, they're, they can be tricky. Yeah. 
Well, what happens with this these signs here, I wasn't sure I was going the right way, so yeah. I backed up before I knew it. I was in that group. I know. They, they need some reflectors there or something. Sometimes backup cameras get folks in trouble. They don't really show depth. And right. right. Uh, is she all right staying in there? Yeah, she'll be fine. Let's see what we got over here for this block. forward a little bit before we do any of that. Want both of them? Well, we might double them up, yeah. I'd say the one's gonna be good by the time we pull it forward. Well, we'll just have to pull it forward just a smidge. Yeah, I got the... The emergency brake and everything's on? Yeah. Yeah, that'll be fine for, for just a second until we get this a little bit of pressure. Yeah. Yep. Okay, hold up. We got pressure on that block, so that should ride us up there. If you want, if you want to go ahead and hop in and then just put it into neutral, okay. and uh, you can steer whatever direction you, yeah, that'll be fine, the, the direction it is there. Just neutral would be the best thing. Okay. Uh, and no emergency brake. No I just press yeah. that pedal to get it off, right? Yeah, you can press it off. Yeah, and it, it should pop back up for you. He'll hear me. Okay, you can go forward. Okay. I'm not gonna get my block. My block's gonna be done. Can I get it? Can I rescue it? Goodness, I can't believe I rescued it. That was a water rescue. <laughs> it got him up. It went it, yeah, it, it fell down, but that's okay. Is he, is he out? He's out. Yeah, he could pull. If you want, you can pull forward just a little bit. <laughs> yeah, no problem. We'll get out of your way here. Okay. Are you guys heading up, up that way? We're going back to the right. Oh, okay. So I'm right in your way then. No, you're yeah. <laughs> You're welcome. You make some bystanders happy, guys. Hey, buddy. How are you? Can I can I give you some toys? I seen you over there checking the tow truck out. What? You can have anything in there you want, my friend. <laughs> He's got a sister. Can you get something for her? Absolutely. <laughs> those, are, those are pretty cool. Let's see if your sister... What do you think? What do you... Big sister? Little sister? Big sister. I don't even... Let me... I think she will like the You think the red? Yeah. Let me see if we got a red one here. Bottom. At the very bottom? You're pretty good on that eye right there, aren't you? Let's see here. There's a red one. Oh. Yeah, that's You're going to need more hands, aren't you? <laughs> <laughs> How about some suckers? Do you think you and sister be okay with suckers? <laughs> what What color do you want? How about How about big sister? She going to want... Do you think she's a red? She might be a red. <laughs> you like blue? Awesome. Good deal. I'm gonna load I'm gonna load you up. Here, how about a sticker too? You want uh we got a couple of those stickers. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you guys so much. You guys enjoy your stay, okay? You too.
awesome guys that's perfect making them happy right there okay guys rolling back through the shack bark uh, gate here Let's see if we can might be able to get some information I got him out. It wasn't too bad at all. Man, thanks for that fast service. Yeah, no problem. Yeah. What, what was your name again? Terry Johnson. Terry Johnson. And what's your wife? Her wife's name is Michelle. It'd tickle her to death if you said a, you know, like a shout out to Michelle Johnson. For we, we got them going funny. right here. So guys, Michelle Johnson. We're going to give a big shout out. We got Terry here at the, at the gate. Um, but thank you so much for watching and, and getting Terry um, a, a cap. I guess it's coming in the mail, hopefully. I oh, no, already got it. Yeah, already got it too, sir. I also got a shirt too. So, man, y'all are the best. You take care of uh, us up here and our community. Well, we appreciate that. We try to help out a bunch. We we got some extra smiling faces. So we had we had a couple of little ones watching us winch out back there. So I loaded them up with uh, with little toy fire trucks and ambulance and suckers and they were so excited <laughs> he, he ran back in the house to give all that stuff to his sister and uh so that was really cool man that's that kind of stuff that really means something, you know <laughs> it's i'm telling you youtube helps us in in getting that stuff out there so we're happy to do it and um yeah it's it's very rewarding thanks so much brother yep no problem be careful out there. Yeah, enjoy that Super Bowl if you got a TV in there, hopefully. All the comforts at home. <laughs> See ya. Thank See ya. You. So, Michelle and Terry, you guys are awesome. If you guys have never been up into Shag Bark, uh, it's a really cool place. Um, I know when we were we were house hunting in the area, we we had come across a couple of places that were up here. It's a gated community. Uh, the gatehouse, as you can see, nothing but nothing but nice, friendly hometown hometown folks that are going to take care of you in every way possible. You know, he he dispatched us out to to help that guy that was he was having a bad day. You know. Um, but uh, we were able to make that day a little bit brighter. We got him out, and like I said, the, just the smiles, the smiling faces of the kids. Anytime they see the lights and the tow truck, and we're out there moving cars around and hanging them in the air, and it's it's always exciting. I know it's exciting for me. That's why I do what I do, and uh, you know, like I said, it's it's really cool. I don't know if the camera caught it, but the the little boy was watching from the driveway. He was standing over in the driveway watching the entire winch out. So he was Yeah, mom brought him down to the end of the driveway so he could he could check it out and and it was just kind of uh you know, it was icing on the cake once we we finished up everything and we pulled into the driveway and and uh, we still had lights going, so he ran out onto the porch uh, to watch us, and probably just thought we were turning around. So, uh, you, you know, you guys are you guys are amazing by giving us you know all these toys and, and suckers and things like that. We were able to pull in there and you know and get out and and have a an interaction with those with those folks. But uh, like I said, guys, it's Super Bowl Sunday, five eighteen. Um, I'm hoping to get over uh, to the uh, to the Chiefs. Uh, Chief of Police, not the Chiefs. <laughs> <laughs> to the Chiefs too, I guess. Uh, to the party <laughs> and meet some of the some of the folks that in the administration office that maybe we hadn't had a chance to say hello to or uh, put some uh, faces with some voices. Yes, that's always cool. So stick around, stay tuned, guys. Uh, it's they did get some snow up in uh, up in the higher elevations. I think they're four to six or so as far as I know at this moment um, like I said Sunday about 20 after 5 um, didn't really get much down here that the temperature stayed just above so we're 40 my, my truck says 41 so uh, Kristen said earlier 10 more degrees and we'd have been uh, we'd have been shoveling and uh, probably a lot more wind. but it doesn't really matter the rain brings just as crazy on on our uh, our wrecks and and recoveries driveways are a little slick today so probably going to encounter a few more of those uh, slide offs or winch outs before the night's over but hopefully we can get over to the party and at least say hey before before we get back into the evenings i'd say after the super bowl when everybody's kind of moving around it's probably going to get busy again so anyway i'll quit rambling and uh we're going to get to where we need to get to and i'll see you guys on the next one Jeff was quicker than I was with the camera. Jeff was quicker with the truck than I was with the camera. See a hotel parking pass. Right there's the sign.
wonder if this is real world drive. Are you sure? A little saber? Aren't they like fancy? The parking brake is set. It's gonna squirt again. Oof. I wonder if they hit this car when they pulled in. This car's got a bunch of white paint on it. Really? Yeah. That's interesting. Yeah, it does. It does, isn't it? I don't know. I don't see any red on this one. That car's seen some stuff. You've seen some stuff. <laughs> Hang around with you long enough, that happens. The parking brake is not set. Right next to the sign. Like right there, both just head. Yes, it is. All right, I will watch. Shouldn't have too much trouble, but. There's tons of room today. Hey, this is Jeff. Everything Auto. I just missed your call. Yes, I am looking for a white 204 vehicle saver with Black County tags. Uh, is parked there behind uh, Dick's. Yes, ma'am. Uh, they were called. They called for removal. Okay. Well, I need to get it. Okay. As long as you're the registered owner, ID matches registration. We can release it back to you. Uh, the cost. Yeah. The cost is. Okay, where are you located? Uh, 221 Newman Road. 221 Newman Road. Where is that close to? Uh, we're right down the road there off of 321 by the city impound. Or uh, DNS builders. I used to work up here in Gatlinburg, but I live in Maryland. So, I'll just be in Gatlinburg for a while. Yeah, yeah, 221 Newman Road. If you can, just give me a call when you think you're going to be close, and we'll get somebody back over to the gate. I don't keep anybody over there after hours. All right, well, I'll be there shortly. Okay, thank you. Okay, everything auto? Okay, and I was just talking about the little saver. I'm on delay, and it says that I'm just like five minutes away. Okay, I'll probably be probably 10 or 15 minutes at least here. Okay, what was the number? Uh, 221. 221. 221 Newman, yep. All right, thank uh, you. Thank you. Bye. Grocery shopping. Hello. Hey. Uh, registered owner? Yep. Uh, if you got keys, I'll bring it up here to you. Oh. Uh, I was going to, you got the keys, you got my card. <laughs> 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 Let's see if I can get it up here to you. Oh, you got a phone or something? They're going crazy. It's mine. <laughs> and I was, because I got down the sidewalk, I was like, damn, that's the first time ever 
I've ever left my phone in the car. That wasn't a good time though. <laughs> no. They got, they got you parking back there, uh, bad spots, I guess. Yeah, well, <laughs> yeah, it's definitely not like it used to be 20 years ago when I lived and worked up here. Yeah, they're pretty serious about their parking around here anymore. They'll call us for uh, any of those spots. I always tell all my people, just pay to park. It's way cheaper. <laughs> oh, no, no. Thanks. Happy <laughs> Valentine's Day to me. <laughs> <laughs> well, you almost blended in. I thought you worked back there. When they called me, I was like, what's well, got local Tennessee Tennessee tags and Tennessee on the door? And uh, Well, <laughs> that was the thing. When I pulled out, I was like, okay, look. I said, there's Pop County, there's Sevier County, I'm Blount County. We'll be fine. Yeah, I thought, we'll I thought she fine. surely works over here someplace, but they yeah. said, nope, nope, she doesn't. <laughs> All right. I'm like, that work? I admit, it's got to be the... Sorry. I mean, my God, you got 20 bucks. Oh my God, you seriously leave me with one dollar <laughs> in my freaking pocket. Sorry. <laughs> oh my God. All right, thanks, man. Yeah, there's that receipt. Yeah, I'm gonna paint a park. <laughs> I'm gonna burn that sucker, boy. Paint it a park. <laughs> yeah, thank you. You're welcome, dear. You heard it first, guys said she pulled back in there and there was a bunch of local plates and she thought ah I'd be okay I'm back here with all the local plates and uh, well she says it's not like it was 20 years ago Virginia tags mm -hmm. I'll see anyone running yet It's unlocked, believe it or not. This rear tire looks flat. It has all kinds of stuff in it. Dent there. Scratches. That rear tire looks really low. Well, that's good. I don't see anybody. Up. Might just be the way it's sitting. But it's about yeah. All right, I'll let you get out of here so you don't get anything. Not like you would get anything anyway, but you know. to like scoot out a bit it's gonna be close here mm -hmm. a mile six inches Car. What kind of car you got here? Red Ford Focus. Mm, yes, ma'am. You were uh, in the employee parking lot. Okay. I'm sorry. Oh, it's okay. As long as you're the registered owner, ID matches, uh, we can release the vehicle back to you. The cost is... Cash? Okay. Um, how can... You can bring it back to me? No, ma'am. It has to be picked up at our lot. Um, 
it's uh, it's already back here at the lot. Uh, no idea where that is. Um, I can um, text it to this number, or I can give it to you, and you can write it down, or. Uh, can you text it to me, please? Yeah, I'll text it to you. Okay. Right, thank you. Thank you. Uh huh. Bye. -bye. All right. Bye. Well, she was nice. Mm -hmm. Everything auto. Hey, I just wanted to let you know that I'm less than a half a mile away. I'm on foot to come get my car. Okay. Uh, yeah, we'll we'll uh, have somebody over at the, at the gate waiting. Okay. Thank you. Uh, thank you. Bye bye. Bye. Hello. Oh, that's a long walk, man. I. Forty five minutes. I'm. Uh, <laughs> Somebody I know made bad decisions on parking today, huh? <laughs> I see, it said parking, so I went back in that direction. Yeah, you. I was driving, so I didn't get out on the other side. You, you, you parked right beside the sign that said not to. Yeah. He got out on the passenger <laughs> side. I did. No, it's okay. If you got keys, I'll bring it up here to you. You got the keys. It took him all the time. <laughs> I guess you got scenic. Gatlinburg today. Yeah. <laughs> oh goodness. A break. I'm sure he probably doesn't have Kit Kat bars on him. How much is it? It's y'all should be ashamed of yourselves. <laughs> it's a uh, there's that receipt. Make, not make sure, sure what you'll do with that, but yes, it's not that expensive. We're in the wrong business. <laughs> no sh I'm One you toe, you can go business. home and chill for the rest of the life. If you got it. All right, guys, pay to park. It's way cheaper. Good it's way cheaper. Good advice. <laughs> you too, man. Good, solid advice. Okay, guys. I feel like I shouldn't have to explain this, but um, in the hopes of saving a really cool UTV for the area, and you know, I guess maybe some of the rental places should explain this better. But we're picking up this Polaris RZR. We're here in downtown Pigeon Forge. Somebody had rented this. They're here at the gas pump. And they're gonna put some fuel in it. If you come over to the side, there's a little cap right here that says uh, fuel. You unscrew it, uh, put the stuff in there. But these folks decided to, instead of putting gas in there, <laughs> oh God. Okay, so they come up to the top of the bed and they opened this cover and they put gas inside the engine. So they unscrewed the oil cap and they pumped, they pumped until uh, fuel was running out of the top of the motor instead of putting it in, in, uh, I can't even do this. In, in, no, they really had to go hunting for that. Uh, you really have to hunt for that, yeah. Um, and, I mean, they pulled on the right side. It's, they pulled on the fuel side. Uh, I don't know what to think about that, guys. But, uh, hey, just one of those things that I thought was pretty bizarre and I would enjoy sharing with YouTube. So, uh, don't, put, uh, don't put gas in the oil. 